Super Smash Brothers fans, get ready to settle it in Smash! Hey, this is Tyler, aka Blue Mage 492, Grand Lethal 16, coming at you with another unboxing today. Super Smash Brothers Wii U came out this morning or midnight last night if you had it pre ordered at a midnight launching party. I picked up my copy at Best Buy, uh, rushed down there first thing when they opened, and picked up the limited edition version that comes with a Nintendo GameCube controller with that fancy little Smash Bros ball insignia and an adapter so you can plug in a number of GameCube controllers. So if you were playing back in the days of Melee, you've got all the equipment you already need. Let's get ready for an unboxing. Before we do, let's look at any possible pre-order bonuses that were out there. So if you pre-ordered at GameStop, you were given a Super Smash Brothers Champion belt just for showing up. I went to the midnight launch to pick up Pokemon, couldn't get Super Smash Brothers at GameStop, but I still was hooked up with the Super Smash Brothers Champion belt anyway. You know, it's wrestling style. Here's a copy of it in belt form. It looks pretty cool. I wear this around the house. Whenever I'm playing Super Smash Bros. on the 3DS, I'm going to be wearing it when I play this on the Wii. This is pretty cool. And it was free. There was no stipulation. I believe if they have extras, you can still pick it up at GameStop. And now on to the game. So it's in this highly glossed box. I paid $99 for this. Normal Wii U games in this day and age for uh, first party games, you know, nothing, nothing third party, are about $59.99 typically. So if you look at... All things that are featured in here, which is right up here, you do have this adapter. The adapter is the only thing I can't really price right now because there's never been a GameCube adapter for the Wii. But controllers right now, if you were to go onto Amazon and pick up a Nintendo GameCube controller, they're about 30 bucks. Unless this this adapter, which I'm I have seen uh, some offers on Craigslist where people are trying to sell it as early as this morning, um, unless they only go for $10, this is a pretty good deal just out the bat, just based on math. All right, let's open up and see what we got in here. Uh, there we go, it's all snug in here. The value is just bursting at the seams. First, we've got this copy of Super Smash Bros for the Wii U. Let me get this open real quick here. I can't control myself freaking out off screen here. Oh man, that's so beautiful. Look at that. Yeah. Comes with a beautiful game. Look at all this intensity. We got super. We got all the Smash Brothers uh, mascots, plus a couple newbies up in the corner. We got DK up there. Samus is charging up that energy beam. Pikachu's got a volt tackle uh, hanging off the back of its tail. I don't know if you can see that. And Mario's up to no good, getting ready to do his uh, little heart remover move from. Uh, Indiana Jones. So yeah, a lot of action just on the screen again. Of course, there's a Club Nintendo inside the jacket as they now do. Um, and all the moves are in here too. So they start with, uh, of course, the uh, Me Fighters. Let me get this move back for a minute. And they go down to Mario, DK, Link, Samus, Yoshi, Kirby, Fox, and Pikachu. So another interesting thing I did recall about this game. I don't know if you can see this here. Excellent. So the... Um, the characters you made, the custom characters you built in 3DS can be transferred to the Wii U and I believe vice versa. So if you find something that worked in the 3DS, you've been rocking for about a month now, you can bring it forward to play on the big screen. Let's see, is there anything else? They just keep going with characters. Um, I know Mewtwo is a later character, so Mewtwo is not included in here right now. They're also explain how the Amiibos work, so if you're interested in playing with Amiibos, there's, there's those options as well. And about eh, half the disc, you know, full color, glossy printed sheets, is in English. The other half is in Spanish. Now let's go on to what else is in this box. Super excited. Let's see. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, is this it? This is brand new Wii U GameCube controller adapter. It's got a couple of USB here. I don't know what they're for yet. But you can plug it up to four controllers. This is pretty cool because a lot of people like me aren't very good with the Wii Remote. I'm pretty good at Smash Brothers, but the Wii Remote and me never really kicked it off. So if I can plug in a GameCube controller, I'm great. If my friends can, fantastic. I got about nine or ten GameCube controllers that I've been tweaking on to make sure they're perfect for Smash. And this will give us a real head up. I mean, especially if you pick up a second Wii U and you have other controllers, you could, in theory, play online with eight people in the same house. So that's going to be nuts. That's 
the ultimate in Smash for the holidays. Another thing I'm noticing, this is quite durable. I mean, I'm not going to hit it against the counter, but it is quite solidly constructed. It, it doesn't feel light and chintzy. It doesn't feel like something third party. This is this is quality Nintendo product. Let's see what is next in this bad boy? What? Look at that. Oh man, I gotta pull this out. I swear this controller is longer than GameCube controllers tend to be. I don't know if you can tell there. This controller looks like it might be 10 feet, maybe more. I'm not 100% certain. I'll, I'll measure it and I'll be able to tell you later. It's got that beautiful insignia and that silver. It looks like it isn't something that would just scratch off too, which makes me happy. The buttons are tight like a new GameCube controller. D-pad's a little tight actually. This controller is lighter than GameCube controllers typically are, and that is one thing I'm a little curious about why that might be. I wonder if this controller might perhaps um, not have a rumble feature. I'm not sure yet. I'd be happy to look at some forums later in the next couple days and get back to you all on that. Let's see, so they tell you about the components for the controller adapter. So I guess it takes two USB plugs in the Wii U to use this and it shows you exactly how you're supposed to plug them into the front. See if they give any disclaimers in here. Nope, it's quite simple. They have some troubleshooting. So you can plug it into the front or the back. If the game you're playing supports five or more characters, two GameCube controller adapters may be used at the same time. Please refer to the manual for the game you're playing for controller requirements right here. That might be a hint to something in the future happening. We might be looking at the option of locally playing uh, with eight people, which would be nuts. I, I pity the Wii U that's got to support that. I don't know if the processor can handle it, but it would be pretty neat. And I wonder if this GameCube controller adapter could be used for other games. Like, I've got... Wind Waker for the Wii U and HD. I've got a handful of other games. I'm going to try out in the next week to see what it works on and do a does it GameCube controller adapter. Ah, uh, just the controller little booklet. I don't know why there is one for the controller. Ah, uh, it just tells you where the buttons are. Cool. So if you uh, bought this by accident and don't know how a GameCube controller works, you will be covered too. So it came, of course, with the game. 60 bucks on its own. It comes with a controller that ranged anywhere from 30 to $40. And then honestly, you could almost look at the Wii U GameCube adapter as a bonus just to really express how Nintendo is behind their product. They're making their comeback and they want you to enjoy everything they have to offer. So this is a crazy bundle. I definitely would highly recommend if you can get a copy of it, get it. If they're charging a couple hundred, I'd hesitate. But you know, for a hundred bucks, this is a great deal. I'm super excited. Now, I will be posting in the comments my uh, friend coder my me whatever you need to know to f play me so um yeah definitely get on there uh challenge me at smash i love to use luigi greninja ike and uh, little mac among others so bring your a game because i'll be ready for you i'm gonna be wearing my champion belt too this is tyler aka blue mage 492 aka grand lethal 16 and thank you so much for watching